Welcome back, everybody. Okay, so we're going to start on that, um... Blah. The mushroom farm. I don't really know why. I don't really use mushrooms very often. But... It'll be fun. Just to have it, you know? I mean, who knows when you'll need mushrooms. Okay, so I... I'm going to do exactly what Etho did, pretty much. And that means that it's going to be made out of stone bricks, just because I think it looks pretty cool. Um, I don't know if you guys think so, but stone bricks are probably my favorite building material. It's just that I um, I usually dig out my houses into sides of things, so I don't usually build with it. <clears throat> so, um, right in front of this pressure plate is where the is where the mushrooms are going to be deposited, just like right in front of me there. Which I should actually... I don't know. I'll do that later. Okay, so... Let's see. We've got this part. That part uh, is just going to be the, the viewing area. <laughs> has nothing to do with um, the actual thing, so I can just get rid of that for now. And then, let's see. We want... in here and it's unfortunate that I've got all this stupid gravel in the background um, I am going to do that just because uh, you'll see later okay so now mushrooms go here um, piston goes there Wow, oh, it's glitching out on me. Alright, um... Let's see, piston goes there, which means... Down here, I'm gonna have to dig down beneath. One, two, three. Okay, so this is where I'll pull the wire from. And then, okay. <laughs> so, under there, and then I go forward. One, two, three, four, and then just over one. But in there I need to have one, two, three, four, and then that should be, yep, okay. So there's that block, and that block, okay, and now I need to go grab redstone stuff. I should have grabbed this stuff before I actually started. Um, I just need one of these and some dust. Again, it's very simple circuit. Um, like, I, I don't even call it a... I wouldn't even call it a circuit. It's just <coughs> some redstone. <laughs> oh, cool. I can take out this part. That allows me to just... Just run that along there, put the torch there, and then all right. Okay, that was probably more difficult than it had to be. Um, that goes there. That goes there. Let's see. I can fill in. I want to fill in as much as possible without breaking anything. Yeah, like I just did. <laughs> okay. So, I can't put a block here. Um... There. Now I should be able to put a block here and there. And... Mm. But again, then I can't do... Um, here. 
I will just take this, stick it down here, all right, that works just fine, um, and then put that back, that back, oh, do I, I don't want to fall in, oh, I can just, okay, um, now I said piston goes there, yes, yep, piston goes right on top of that block. Um, okie dokie, now that block, that one, that one, that one, um, There, there, there. Now I need some water. I only have one bucket filled with water, so I'll just run out real quick. Grab another bucket from my little pool here. Run back inside, close my cool glass doors. Also, because they're glass, I can't get, like, squished between them. Um, because glass doesn't suffocate you if it you manage to trap your head in it. Oh, and I'll grab my mushrooms, too. Just one of each. Because that's all I need. And this mushroom farm will grow both types of mushrooms. So, um, I don't need to worry about... Because mushrooms grow pretty slowly. Um, so they shouldn't, like, interfere at all with each other, really. Oh, and I need two sticky pistons. Doki, and there, and then move that. That doesn't need to be there. That's going to be that. And then this one's going to be empty, but I'm going to just turn these into those blocks. And then these ones, and these ones. Ugh, stupid gravel. It's always there when you don't want it to. Want it to be. And again, I'm just doing what Etho did, because, um... This way, all the blocks... Okay. Nope! Ugh. God. So bad at this game. Alright, here's one. Now I'll just have to go grab that other water again. <laughs> because you are not listening to the brightest Minecraft player. And then that goes there. Okie dokie. Now... Um, oh. Whoops. That one, that one, that one, and that one. And then just fill that in. I can put that back there, put that back there. I didn't... Did... What? Did I only put one mushroom in? Alright, did one of those mushrooms grow while I was doing this? <laughs> okay. That's a little strange. I can't say I was expecting that one. Mostly because I wasn't. Okay, so now as that grows, as the mushrooms in there grow, um, I will remove that torch from that wall. And just, like, put it over here or something. So it should be dark enough in there, I think, to do it. So as I step on this, when they grow, they'll get pushed off and then pushed right to me. So, woohoo! And that's, like, just in time. I've got... 20 seconds left on this video. Um, so I'm thinking I'm going to put like some kind of elevator or just stairway right here. And that'll just go up to the next floor, and I'll do something like a, a wheat farm up there, or actually I might make a reed farm and a wheat farm, and make them auto-harvesting like this. So, I mean, I'll have to go in and check on them to make sure I want to harvest them first. But, 
Or I suppose for the reed farm I could make one that detects growth, but I don't know how I'm going to do that for wheat. It just seems a lot more difficult. Anyway, okay, so, yep, I'm over. And that's my mushroom farm, or that's Ethos Mushroom Farm. Totally stole it from him. But uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.